Alright, so once upon a time I've read the Book of Changes Princeton edition to which I always return and uh, I read a very interesting fragment which stated that good fortunes are made by consecutive good decisions marked by perseverance in the good environment. Likewise, bad fortunes are made over months and years to fruition of a bad fortune made by bad decisions in bad environments and so on and so on. So it's not a matter of uh, luck, good luck or bad luck. So I've decided to conjure a little program. I used ChatGPT to create the script for me and uh, I wanted to... Uh, okay. I wanted to use several variables to establish a simulation introducing a measure of randomness over the years how is good and bad fortune made so the environmental variable is what kind of family you were born into what kind of fortunes wealth status were you born into i was born in a stat artistic family in warsaw poland which is already downgrading you in the post-communist times 1990s so let's say that that was the second world or the developing world back then so that would be five zero is the worst ten is the best next one diamond we are all inborn with a certain soul or a diamond which is of variable qualities now i'm a proud possessor of a very noble diamond so I score high on this one, 8. Socialization, your peers, your mentors, well I had plenty of friends but were they inspiring me to great things or quite to the contrary, I would find it neutral. Education, I received western education and I've spent tons of hours in the National Library of Wales, Scotland and Poland studying. So let's say that the quality of my education was quite high. Judgments. Someone said that I'm praised for my objectively good decisions and judgments. Whether that is correct, I do not know. Let's say seven. Given the circumstances. Karma or the inclinations. Networked karma. So if you pull the wrong string, things happen. If some things pull the wrong strings, things may happen to you. Well, my karma was quite fucked up because uh, based on the privileges and certain status I was uh, destroyed by envy and stupidity and delusion. So that means that I'm scoring low on karma not due to my own faults but due to the setting. Fates. I had good fates. Given the circumstances, seven perseverance. I am an indestructible bastard given what I lived through. Nine. Instability factor. First, we will run a stable calculation and then we will proceed to a chaotic calculation of fates. Enter a number of years for simulation. So, these are our starting points. I lived through 37 years. And let's see, what do we have here? Huh. So, good fortune. 6.5 for throughout the years. If times would then change and nothing will change, I would have relatively good fortunes. That means I would score high on good fortunes. Yet that was not the case. So let's start again. Environmental 5, Diamond 8. Socialization 5, Education 8, Judgment 7, Carbon 2, Fates, let's say 6, Perseverance 9. But when things in real life happen, the randomness, the dice are cast. 37 years of my existence. Now this is not necessarily true what will emerge, but that is what may happen. As you see, that is true life, so starting points are differing than the end points. And all of a sudden, in the 37th year of my life, 
I may have extremely bad fortune as my good fortune is destroyed. And these are periods and sequences of our lives when we may act, when we may create, and so on and so on. Just like happiness is not forever, war is not forever. Happiness is just a state when we do not suffer and are not in a state of pain. So, I hope this gives you a great reflection on your life. If you have good moments and good fortunes in your life, use them wisely, responsibly, and act. This is the small window in your life when you can act decisively and make it noble, great, ethical, strong, and perfect. Now, when bad fortunes hit you, you must prepare yourself when the good fortunes in your life arise. You must recognize them to prepare yourself for the bad times because they will always happen unless you are a spoiled child of status. So, yeah, that's about it. Never lose hope because it might be even worse. Sometimes better. <laughs>